So I got my first Enviro cloth and wanted to try it out really tough. My house is has been built by us. It's been very slow going. It's still not complete. But one of the things I love is all of my windows. If you know me, you know I don't have very many curtains or shades. I love being able to look out the windows and see the trees. But because we are in the woods, we get a lot of mow, mildew, and just just dirty on the outside of the windows so fast. And it's been really tough to keep up with the windows. And it's been a long time since I've cleaned them. So I spent a day only working on five windows, among other things, with the Enviro cloth. And I also used the window cleaning cloth, which I, I learned as I went how to use it better. So one of the things I learned was that when you clean with the window cloth and you're using just water, that really it needs to be a little more than damp. What I take as damp um, really dries too quickly. And then once you are ready to go with the window cloth, it's already dry. So what I would do is have a slightly more than damp. I mean, you don't want it dripping by any means, but to clean the window with the wet Enviro cloth and then use the window cloth to polish it from there. I have rather large windows and so I really had to just kind of work on a section at a time. If I did the entire window, by the time I was done with the Enviro cloth, the window was already dry. So I learned that just to do one section at a time and then dry it. My smaller windows, um, I just did like the top half and then the bottom half. Yes, this is my kitchen window that I look out when I'm washing. You can see the ladders there from having our siding put on and the paint, new paint being put on just recently. And there's the cloth afterwards with all the stains and snags.